Who's the best solution? The best mother salesman. Everybody know what heating and cooling is? You guys like cold showers and shit? You sickos do. But most of you people that are like me, that like hot, warm showers, you need a dude like this guy that can make sure that you get warm showers. Am I right? Sort of. <laughs> Tell us what it is. So it's your furnace and air conditioner, heating and cooling. Okay, if your furnace don't work, does the water get hot? Does it? Yeah. Well, fuck, man, I'm not an electrician either, am I? <laughs> All right, tell us what it is. Heating and cooling, is that right? Yeah. You mean like in your air conditioner and shit? That'd be a water heater that you're thinking of. It's all the same. Yeah. All right, let's move on. <laughs> let's not, let's not get caught in the details. Yeah, everything creates heat dude i'm on fire right now brother. It's all okay so anyways i would have made them think they didn't want cold showers anyways and we would have done the deal but let's get on to what this is he's talking heating and cooling like we're sitting in this room is that right Correct. but people don't like to sit in a hot ass house Correct. when it's 100 degrees outside Correct. right they want it cool okay the winter, they need heat also. okay there we go okay cool so we all know it's about heating and cooling in the home right yeah okay cool so you go in by the way he goes in and does inspections does that make sense am i right are you going to fix something? Am I right? I go in to design systems as a comfort advisor and sell them new equipment. Is okay, cool. So what's the objection? But we do both. Yeah, they do inspections too. So uh, my objection that I'm getting lately is, you know, Marcus, I, I understand. And if this was our home where we lived, then absolutely we would go ahead and just pull the, pull the stops out and we would move forward. And you know, too bad you guys aren't in Valley. We need you guys in the Valley. But up here, I think we're just gonna choose the cheap option and go with one of your competitors because they're a third the money you are. And this is our winter cabin, we don't really care. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Andy. A lot of you leave comments Tell me that you need help. Do me a favor, I'm gonna tell you the best way to get a hold of me. Shoot me a text message right now, 918-210-0254, 918-210-0254. I'll help you with whatever you need. I got your back for life. Let's get back to the video. Okay, well, number one, you do care because we wouldn't have any conversation about heating and cooling if you didn't care. Am I right? Yes. So you do care. And let me ask you a question. Obviously, you have enough money where you have a second home. Am I right? True. Okay, cool. So you, so you value your money. Yeah. Am I right or right? You're right. Okay, do you like cheap stuff? No. Um, not necessarily. Okay, cool. So why are we talking about cheap stuff? So what I want you to know is that going with cheap stuff, you get what? You get cheap work. Now, I'm going to ask you a question. Would you rather do something two or three times or do it once right? I bet you wouldn't have had the money to buy this place by doing things the wrong way. You probably do them the right way, and that's how you end up being where you're at in, my li in, in life. Am I right? Yep. Now, I'm going to ask you a question, and just straight up. By the way, if the answer is no and you want to go the cheap way, I'm going to explain this to you. I'm going to go service another house. It's no big deal. But when this other guy who comes in who puts a cheap system in, when that breaks, you're going to have to call them back. And when you're staying on the phone with an operator for three or four hours and you're getting pissed off and your skin's boiling and nobody's answering or taking your calls and they say they can't come back out for two weeks, but you guys were planning to be out here for a vacation, which you can't have now because it doesn't, it's not heated or cooled, you're going to be pissed off. More than likely. No, no, I know you are because talking to you right now, I can tell that it would bother you. I've learned you in, in a couple minutes that look, you're a guy that has money. You can spend the money. You don't have to spend the money, okay? You're trying to see it as there value in it. When you're ready to take your vacation, do you want to take it when you want it? Yes or no? Yes, I do. There's your value. I will tell you this. If I can ensure that spending a little more money doing the job right, I can ensure that your property will always run effectively at the time when you guys are ready to come, which is priceless. And I can ensure that we do it quick, we do it in a timely manner, and we can do it professional. So we'll never have to have this conversation again. And we can put conversations like this to bed forever. And if you ever need nothing, something, you call me. Here's my personal cell phone. It's the one my wife calls me on. If you ever call me and I don't answer, call the insurance company because I'm dead. I will assure you, my name is Andy Elliott. If you call me about heat or air, we will be over at the house and we will be taking care of it. And the other way is the cheap way. You're going to do it a couple of times. You'll end up spending more money. Plus, you're not going to get to take vacations when you want. They always screw shit up, which is why they're cheap. They'll probably be a fly-by night business. They'll probably be out of business in four or five years. And I guarantee the guy that comes out won't give you a cell phone number. Now, if you want to do it the right way, let's do it the right way and I'll handle it. All right, fair enough. Now watch. Yeah. Do me a favor. Watch this. If I was in this guy's house, right? I'm in your house. All I did was common sense. 
Okay, I don't care if it was your full home. I would say this, at the end of the day, you've got one house. You spend all your time here. And when the heat and the cool ain't working, I'm gonna tell you, I know that people don't walk around the house in the best mood. And your goal is always take care of your family your whole life, right? If you could write a check for what it would be worth for your family to be in complete comfort your entire life, could you write the check? No, because all you live for is your family. You can write that check right now and I can insure it. I'm going to tell you, I'm not walking out of that house until I make that deal happen. Now, not be because I say that I'm gonna make it happen, because this guy, he wants something. And I'm gonna explain it to you. He's here, right? What does he have? A problem. Am I right? Everybody, your job is to give people a solution. Now, what are people looking for? The best solution. Who's the best solution? The best motherfucking salesman. Hey guys, I just want to tell you, you're the true one percenters. You made it till the end of the video. Do me a favor, share it with the friend that wants to go to another level. Make sure you like the video, comment below so I know who you are. Set your notifications and then subscribe to the channel. We got daily sales training videos dropping. I'll see you soon.